Hey beauties, welcome and welcome back. If you want to see how I did this bomb lock knot bob over my 10 month old two strand twist locks, then please keep on watching. Some things you're gonna need are an edge control, ponytail holders, an oil, rubber bands, as well as something to do your edges with. Also, whatever you're going to moisturize your hair with, I use this aloe vera gel for my retwist and my ends, and we're gonna put some mousse over it at the end. Grab a mirror and whatever hair you're going to use, and let's get started. Before beginning, I separated my hair into three sections. And you never want to do your locks when they're dry, so I was sure to mist my hair with my water mixture. Then I added aloe vera gel to my roots and my ends. I added oil on the top of that, and then I went ahead and two strand twisted my locks. Here you'll notice me unraveling my two strand twist and that is because I'm looking for the budding in my hair and the different thickness and bulkiness of my lock. Since my locks aren't super mature, they do have a lot of texture to them which I love but I did have to work through that when putting this style in my hair. So again, you'll see me unraveling it and then I went ahead and added the extension in a point where I thought it would be good to add the extension without adding more bulkiness to my lock and in case any of you ladies are wondering I have a little bit over 100 locks and I used about one and a half packs of the hair that I showed you at the beginning of the video extensions in is similar to how you do knotless braids or anything like that so I added extensions in bit by bit so the two strand twist would gradually thicken also notice how I attempted to tuck my lock inside of the hair extension so be sure to try to wrap and twist the hair extension around your lock to protect your hair as well as to add uniformity so the hairstyle looks as neat as possible. Another thing I wanted to note to do is if you're adding colored extensions into your hair, maybe the ends of your hair is dyed similar to mine or something like that, I was sure to add the colored extension into my hair where the colored hair started. So I didn't try to mix too much hair with my natural hair color because I don't like the way that looks personally. So if you're like me, I recommend being sure to add your colored extension where the color in your hair starts. I really hope that makes sense. <laughs>
Remember also, if you want your bang to be in your face, then combine locks that go toward your face. And if you want your bang to go away from your face, then combine locks that are pointing in that direction. Tell me now, tell me something, cause I don't know how this gonna end. the final results I was really happy with how they came out the only thing I would do is I probably won't add weave to the very back of my head but other than that it came out exactly the way I wanted it I wanted to do my hair like this for uh, the birth of my baby because I was 37 weeks pregnant here but again I love it and if you give this a try please leave me a comment down below and let me know how it turned out and I hope it turns out well. But that is all I have for you and until next time I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.